Mozilla Complete Tutorial for Beginners Step-by-Step -step Guide. Hello guys, Ilya here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we use this software to build our own website. Basically it's pretty easy, just follow these steps, I do to not make any mistakes. So here we are on mozilla.com and as you can see in the top of the screen you can find some information about this project. We can log in or sign up or we can click on create a website or create an online store. In this case we are going to create a website so let's click on it right up here. After that we'll need to create our account so it's pretty easy, we just simply need to input the uh, our email and then just password. So how can we name with our website? So let it be the name of our channel Helper man, let it be like this. I accept done and in a few seconds We'll come to this page where we need to choose our design our template Basically, we are going to customize as you can see they provide us the opportunity to choose different templates I'm going to use the first one as for me this is the most suitable so let's click we can click on enlarge or select so let it be like this we're just going to click on it here and as you can see we're going to use this one we're going to click on select so after that everything basically is in process so now it looks like this let's click on select and now we are on our editing page as you can see in the right side the best the biggest side here there is like our website preview how does it looks like and there is the opportunity to interact with every single block we are going to uh, change we can change it we can change the position and so on and in the left side there is like option to interact with pages so if we'll click we can find all of the pages on our website home news product services about us and so on so we can change the order of them or we can add the sub page or we can simply delete so let's delete some of pages about services basically about products about uh, news so basically we'll only have three pages home about us and contact in order to create a new page we can just simply click on add new and here we can choose a page type normal page with text front page or special page picture gallery catalog or store web form block or news so let it be block or news so we are going to name it like this the default and click on save so after that it will successfully edit as you can see right up here so also we have like block or news we can add a new post here or we can go to settings go back to website also we have like the design we can change the design here we can choose the another like template or so on so we can just simply change it we can change the colors we can change the color palette basically as you can see we can find the pack of different colors and after that it'll be like successfully used to uh, customize our template I think it's pretty good so I'm just going to use this with red color so I'll just click on close and as you can see our website now looks like this also we have like address area where we can customize our domain and so on so now it looks like this we can also edit it or we can get individual so in order to get we need to buy like paid plans and so on also there's like some extra things uh, we can inform visitors about use of cookies, add sharing buttons to every page of our website, collect emails and so on. So they provide us the opportunity to do this. And also we have like settings where we can find some interface like the name of our website, website icon, we can change it right up here. Google Analytics tracking ID, Facebook pixel ID and so on. Also there's like some other stuff we can add. So just simply click on save changes. And as you can see now our website looks like this uh, not a lot of pages as you can see but we can still edit every single part so uh, in order to edit for example this page we can simply click on edit post and add some stuff we can click on edit and as you can see this is our editor page so here we are we can change like helper man uh, tutorials and here we can write some text about our channel, we can discover different things and so on. I'm just going to click on save and as you can see it was successfully changed. So let's try to add one more page here. I'm going to add maybe a normal page with text or even let's try to add maybe picture gallery. Let's click on save. And as you can see it was successfully added. So here I would like to change the name. Let it be like um, nature 
nature let it be like nature i'm going to delete this text here and as you can see while we are just uh, highlighting something we can change the style we can make it bold change the text type uh, make it like change the style and change the size so in this case uh like uh, mozilla provides us the opportunity to change a lot of different style to make it like a link to make it as a list with numbering with the bullets and so on we can also add like buttons here insert video insert map insert file so there are a lot of options provided by Mozilla. In order to change these pictures, for example, we need to click on edit and then just add something here. We can add a picture, we can create a group. So let's click on add a picture. And as you can see, we can choose it from our computer here. So we can change the order of these uh, images. And basically this is a way of how can we interact. Uh, let's also add something um, something more so we'll come to pages click on add you and let's add maybe a front page or special page let it be like this so as you can see there is like some templates some layouts i'm going to use this one here and as you can see it was successfully added back so here we can change the title let it be like the name of channel uh, here i'd like to write tutorials and so on so in these options we can discover different like things about us and so on you can just simply click change the background also we can add the sections between these things we can click on plus and add some text image video banner product gallery and so on as you can see there are a lot of opportunities we can customize so i suggest you to try it by yourself because there are a lot of options we can use and it's hard to uh, show them in the single video basically these are like our site builder is pretty good so when everything is done we can just simply click on publish and here we need to confirm our uh, mobile phone and after that our like site will be successfully published and as you can see it was pretty good we can also upgrade to premium they have like three paid plans uh, two of them are paid yeah and one is basically three uh, as you can see the differences is quite uh, big like in the storage uh, in the online store uh, capacity, in maximum upload size, and so on. So I suggest you to try it for free, and then you can decide is it like suitable for you to buy the pay like paid plans, eight dollars a month or sixteen dollars a month. You can find all the features here, as you can see. For premium, there is like also advanced e-commerce feature, so it will be helpful for you if you want to build an online store using Mozilla. But yeah, basically this is the way of how can we use Mozilla to create a website. I hope guys this video helped you out. If you have any questions, you can write them in the comments below. That's all for this video. I wish you a very good day. Goodbye.